Welcome back everyone. I'm currently doing a video series on building a large-ish Delta printer. And so I've started with the corners. I don't know why I've started at the corners. Maybe I'm working the outside in. But this is what I've gone for. Some of these. And these are from AliExpress, but I'm sure you can get them from pretty much most places on the internet. Uh, this is the 2040 section. So that there is 2040. 40 being that way. The main reason for that is 2020 is fairly flexible and since, since this is going to be about a metre tall, which I think is about three feet-ish, a bit more than three feet, I don't know, about that. Um, people complain about how flexible 2020 is and I would agree with that. I'm quite disappointed about how flexible the 2020 is. So I've gone for the biggest one, which is 2040 and this is 2060 along the bottom. Now these are the aluminium ones, because if you want rigidity, can't even say it, um, metal is best really, especially if you're going to heat it up. If you buy plastic ones or 3D print things, uh, it's not the greatest thing if you heat it up, so we've gone for aluminium ones. And these are the uh, NEMA 23, yeah, you can get NEMA 20, uh, you, come on. Get it right. There's NEMA 17 and NEMA 23 motor size. Normally they're NEMA 17s that you use for 3D printers. I've gone for 23s uh, because, well, that's what one of the blogs I'm following did. And I'm kind of going on the theory that bigger is best, but it's probably not actually that required. You can get these in 17 or 23 and in different colors, but I've decided to go for black and stay with, um, silver extrusions to get a bit of color contrast but like i said you can get them in plastic uh, i wouldn't buy them in plastic get them in aluminium these do weigh incredibly heavy i'm surprised how much they weigh you obviously got the ones on each end um, smaller ones for the other side the other side being the top this is the top and the bottom and these also come with little wheels for the idler at the top i don't know how good that's really going to be Yeah, these are little idler gears you get, little ball bearings and stuff. You need to make sure if you're buying them, you actually get these parts, because some people, of course, don't sell you these with them. This is for the, uh, the belt to go over. Looks kind of flimsy to me, but I haven't put it together. We'll see. Might replace those. All right, guys. I shall see you on the next one. See ya. Bye-bye.